Here's another shot of this Thomas motor in the uh, inductive kickback and what it sounds like here. Look at the neon here. That's what the LEDs off. The LEDs on. And that's just uh, putting three volts in a five period supercapacitor. It draws a ton, it draws a hundred milliamps. So you're going to have to rewind these little coils. These are these ferrite uh, split shell coils. And I'm thinking 30 gauge for the rewind on that. These are the ones I got at Electronic Gold Mine that I made that uh, jewel thief on the half shell with. There's a little neo magnet buried down inside that thing. And you notice the direction of the coil windings on that. They're parallel to the rotor magnets, and yet this thing still runs. Very interesting uh, little motor. Uh, I'm thinking the electronic circuit on this, at least a Hall effect, or uh, or use the reed switch with a transistor, because the uh, current is so high, the reed switch sticks. And so I'm thinking. Uh, if I go any further with this, you're going to have to put that on a transistor um, because the reed switch uh, sticks. There's too much current for it. But uh, boy, I tell you, this is uh, pretty impressive on the uh, inductive kickback on this thing for such a tiny little thing. I mean, it is it is small. But like I showed in my last video, it's got some torque too because it uh, it ran Maggie. Anyway, I just wanted to show that that uh, that little uh, take the radio away. It doesn't make any noise unless there's a radio near it. Then that's the uh, spark and the reed switch that you're hearing. But uh, yeah, that's. Uh, that thing right there is pretty darn neat coming off of a little tiny motor like that charged up with three volts and all you'd have to do is just take this reed switch to a, a transistor uh, NPN transistor and this would solve this uh, reed stick a uh, reed switch sticking problem but yeah that's that little Thomas motor um, I like that thing that's pretty neat might run, re rewind the uh, coils with 30 gauge to drop the amp draw down a little bit. That's pretty neat stuff.